Tell me about your bubble project. So I started the bubble project uh, six years ago. It's basically a project where 50,000 stickers in the shape of beach bubble were printed. I placed them all over New York City and left them empty for people passers-by to fill them in with their thoughts and writings and drawings. And then I go back and photograph what people do and then I post them on the website. And now it's become kind of an open project where people around the world are doing their own bubbles and putting the stickers and photographs. Give me a bit more info on you. What's your background and where did the idea come from? As it really started out of, out of my own frustration working at a corporate advertising agency. And also uh, seeing um, ads all over the place in the public space, which I thought it was very uh, intrusive and most for the most time really ugly and boring. So I wanted to create a, a simple device that would uh, quickly transform this ad into a, a corporate monologue to public ad. This guy, you know, who is this guy? I don't know. So, I like to give him a voice, so he has an opportunity to talk, to talk, say something to the world. Did people have interesting things to say? Many, many comments that are social, political, uh, philosophical, and surreal. And, uh, you know, New Yorkers are very uh, active and uh, creative. Um, a lot of people on the street. So I have an incredible collection of what people wrote, which are fascinating. The great thing about the Bubble Project is that it's open and it's completely free to, for people to speak out whenever they want to. Julie, thanks very much for chatting with us. You're welcome.